Welcome to the enchanting town of Eldridge, where Halloween is not just a holiday, but a season that transforms the very essence of the town. As the days grow shorter and the nights longer, an air of excitement mingles with an unsettling mystery. The streets are cloaked in a fog that seems to whisper secrets of the past, while the scent of damp earth and decaying leaves fills the air. Flickering jack-o'-lanterns line the cobblestone paths, casting long shadows that dance like specters in the night. Join us as we delve into a tale of intrigue and discovery, where the past and present intertwine in unexpected ways. This is chapter one of our story, and the journey is just beginning. Lila Parker, a 14-year-old with long, wavy chestnut hair and expressive hazel eyes, stood at the entrance of the local library. Her heart raced with a mix of anticipation and trepidation. The library, a dusty haven filled with forgotten tomes and whispers of the past, beckoned her inside, promising secrets waiting to be uncovered. Inside, Lila found her friends, Ethan Torres and Maya Chun, already gathered around a table cluttered with old books and artifacts. Ethan, with his short, tousled black hair and glasses perched precariously on his nose, was flipping through a dusty volume, his brow furrowed in concentration. Maya, her long black hair cascading over her shoulders, was animatedly recounting tales of the town's ghosts, her bright brown eyes sparkling with creativity. The trio had always shared a fascination with the supernatural, but tonight felt different. The air crackled with an energy that hinted at the unknown. Maya's voice was a mixture of excitement and awe as she held up an old VR headset, its surface scratched and worn. It says here that it can unveil the town's hidden past. Lila's curiosity ignited at the thought. What secrets lay buried beneath the fog? What stories had been forgotten? Yet, as Ethan's skepticism surfaced, attention began to weave through their conversation. You really think this thing works? He questioned, his analytical mind struggling to reconcile the fantastical with the rational. Before they could debate further, the fog outside thickened, swirling around the library like a living entity. Shadows flickered at the edges of their vision, and an inexplicable chill crept into the room. Ignoring the unease that settled in her stomach, Lila reached for the headset, her determination overshadowing her fear. Let's try it. We need to know what's out there. As they donned the headsets, the world around them dissolved into a hauntingly beautiful landscape, filled with ethereal spirits and unsettling imagery that echoed the town's troubled history. The initial thrill of discovery quickly morphed into a sense of dread as they encountered their first spirit, a figure cloaked in sorrow, who revealed a dark chapter of Eldridge's past. The air grew heavy with tension as Jake, a newcomer to their group, voiced his doubts, creating friction among the friends. Yet, amidst the fear and uncertainty, Lila felt a flicker of resolve. The fog outside mirrored the confusion and weight of unresolved issues that loomed over them, and she knew that their journey had only just begun. Together, they would uncover the truth, no matter how deeply it was buried in the shadows.